I'm thrilled to be here. What a great time to to arrive in in Seattle. You know, both uh, this time of year is such a beautiful time in the Pacific Northwest, but also as things are reopening after COVID, there's just a sense of excitement and anticipation. So I I couldn't be happier. I, I'm looking forward to just learning. I'm looking forward to getting to know new people, interacting with undergraduate students. The newness of the experience is really is, is exciting and, and, and challenging, and I, I like challenges. That's the, probably the thing that stands out for me the most. Reopening is, in some ways, way more complicated than just shutting down. When, when we shut down, we knew exactly what we had to do. You know, we had to go remote and everyone had to figure out how to work from home. But actually, you know, there are so many choices to make as we, as we reemerge. But also trying to kind of reignite the strategic directions process and lift SU and, and kind of refocus uh, based on what we've learned during COVID. So um, I'll be spending a lot of time uh, thinking about how to re-engage in that process now that we're back in person. The demographic challenges that are coming down the pipeline for us as college age, um, as the college age population declines, um, uh, the, the cost of higher education and, and the constraints of, of, of of those costs for our students. So those are things that are not unique to Seattle University, but things that I think we're well positioned to respond to. And those are where our opportunities lie, right? Being a, a school that's both kind of small enough to be personal, but large enough to really offer a breadth of opportunities for our students, our, our physical location right on the edge of downtown, which is a, a you know thriving and um, innovative uh, uh, tech hub for, for the world and, a, and a, a nexus for international trade. We are we're so well positioned to to attract people here, you know, and to innovate in in how we bring together um, uh, technology and our in our deep Jesuit set of values and, and kind of bring those into dialogue with each other. So you know the opportunities are um, are just all around us, and uh, and the question is like how can we how can we really you know take full advantage of of the opportunities that that we have. Well, first of all, thank you for everything you've done to keep the university moving during the last 18 months. I mean, the, the response of faculty and staff uh, to what no one could really predict would happen is, uh, is heroic. I mean, the ability to, to just on a dime shift to uh, remote instruction was this amazing collaborative effort of faculty and staff and and students you know responded with a lot of patience and grace to that as well um, and it went on longer than any of us predicted and any anyone anticipated and and people really you know I just saw people coming together to to meet the challenge to learn new skills and really stretch themselves and get outside their comfort zone in terms of technology and instructional techniques and for, provide students with the best possible educational experience under the circumstances so I was so amazed by 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 how how the university community responded uh, to that challenge so thank you and and you know now we're finally coming out of it and I think that this is a, a time of real hope you know as we really savor the things that we've been missing and also draw the lessons from the experience that, that we can then apply going forward. And you know, the, the skills that we've learned and the muscles that we built, we can, we can deploy to, to do something even better than what we were doing before. Welcome and welcome back. And um, we missed you. And I uh, was looking forward to just having that student energy, all the activity, the, the events, and the people sitting around on the lawn, and conversations that happen when you just bump into people on campus. You know, those are the things that really energize us in higher education. We're, we're all here because of the students. It's not the same when you have to schedule everything over Zoom. So, really looking forward to uh, seeing you back on campus. <laughs>